welcome to another Daisy short. Now, I heard in the latest news and update, uh, they've changed sounds of the zombies, they've added blood splatter, and things like that. So, we are going to go and look for some zombies and uh, pick a fight. And see if we can't see what it looks like and discover it for ourselves. Which will be fun, I reckon. Let's load this up. So we've got another mag. Okay. Pop that there. Pop that there. Okay, where's it put me? Bloody miles away from anything by the looks of it. Aha. Uh -huh. Zombies this way. That was nice and quick. more. Whoa. Oh, wow. Okay. Blood on the ground. Oh yeah, look. Bit of blood spatter there from where I hit him the first time. Yeah, you can see the blood spatter where I've hit him the first time round. Pretty cool. This one. Yeah, I thought I hit him a bit further up. It's just squash clouds. Right, can we see any more around? Right. Also, I believe blood spatter goes in the direction of the bullet as well. So let's give that a go. That's blood spatter. Nice. Oh, can hear footsteps. No, nope, no more sets. I think they're gonna come running by now.
I believe also it's worth mentioning, since there's one here, that you can drink from the wells whilst holding a gun there. You just use one hand for it, like holding the gun in the other hand, rather than that stupid message you used to get, which was, you, you can't fill this item with water, or something like that, you can't fill up this item. Like, who in their right mind would put the barrel of a gun underneath a water fountain and try and fill it up? So, I found myself spawned on the island with the castle on it. I forget what it's called. But you got the lighthouse over there. And I thought we'd try a bit of swimming. After all, it's 6 3. Everything's been improved. Let's see if swimming has. And let's jump off of here into the water. Okay, let's get on with it. Okay, so swimming is quite slow, like this, it does look more natural. Than it did before, and we do a breaststroke, but then if you hit the shift key, which will, is the same as your sprint button, you do an overarm stroke, making you go faster. And it looks like at the moment it doesn't put your stamina bar down. Turning just turns you, you can't look to your left and right like you used to unless you press control. Sorry, alt. Look around. But it feels smooth. And you just change from one to the other quite easily. I'm assuming eventually this will use up stamina. It was a very smooth transition. I want to see what it's like getting out of the water on the other side. Backstroke, but you're more, it's more like treading water. I would like to see if you press shift that you could actually backstroke and go quicker. What would also be nice is, I'm not about everybody else, but when I backstroke and I'm swimming, I find it a relaxed, steady pace and it's a lot less tiring in doing this. So I'd like to see if they do do a backstroke, which would be great. But if they do a backstroke, it's less tiring than the stamina bar. So it's just that extra touch of realism. About going side. You can't can't sort of sideways. No, you can't. Okay, so no sideways stroke. 
can't have everything. Oh wow, look at that for a transition. But I'm, I'm not very healthy. Coming out of it. I think I've also found that on the new player, the new single player, sorry, zombies only tend to be where you spawn. I've not seen them anywhere else yet. Which is a little bit aggravating. I'd like to see zombies everywhere. Uh, anywho, it's another little daisy short. Please let me know in the comments whether you like these daisy shorts. They're just little snippets of information I find out as I play the game. And just little interesting things that I think people might like to know about. But that's swimming, so it's smooth getting in, smooth getting out. The speed up and slow down of the swimming animation using your stamina is problem free, it's, it feels natural. And you can even do a little backstroke kind of tread of the water as well, which is, is kind of nice. Anyway, that's enough for that one. Uh, thanks for watching. Let me know what you think of these in the comments. I'll keep doing them if people are enjoying them. Uh, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye for now.